Hey, hello guys, how are you doing? I hope great. This is Jimmy DJS91 here, and be welcome to my 100% walkthrough of Doing 2 Hell on Earth for the PC. Play it through the Doomsday Engine source port on the Ultra Violence difficulty. So, today we are going to play map 2 that is called Underhauls. So, let's get to it. Alright, so let's grab these health bonuses here on the left. And then he's sneaking to to kill this Zombieman very easily. And then open this door to kill more Zombieman inside his room. And a shotgunner here on the left. Also flip the switch. And these are the red bars. Keep in mind of they, where they are, we'll come back here later. Uh, flip that switch will open this area here, allowing uh, to us access to the underhouse. And then I stand still right here to kill uh, three gunners that come into sight. And then kill this shotgunner here on the right side. He can be easy to miss. Then I go into here to kill more guys. And sneak into the right side to kill this gentleman. But don't go into there yet. Instead, I go back and go through this door. On this room, let's kill loads of gunners, shall we? And then here at the very end, there is the first improvement of Doom 2 compared to the original Doom. That is a brand new weapon that looks like the regular shotgun that we are already using, but actually it is not. Actually it is... Yes, the super shotgun. Yes, this awesome weapon. But don't worry, it will not replace your regular shotgun. You have the two weapons at the same uh, weapon slot. Uh, the Super Shotgun is a double-barreled, uh, sawed-off, break-action shotgun that, according to the, Doom, to the Doom Wiki, it is uh, three times more powerful or near to that than a regular shotgun. So, to deal with a group of enemies or tough enemies at close range, well, this weapon is the choice for you, especially as a good alternative to the rocket launcher, since it does not have uh, splash damage in close range. So yes, anyway, let's exit and then go up and kill these guys through the window, sniping them with the regular shotgun. And then kill all the gunners here on the perimeter, and then I will demonstrate to you the power of the super shotgun. Yes, indeed, it can deal with a group of gunners so easily at close range. That's why I love this gun. Uh, also, I forgot to mention that the Super Shotgun uh, fires two shells per time instead of one, but since it has three uh, times more power than a regular shotgun, so it's a good deal. Anyway, don't forget to go back to deal with this trap with the gunners that was triggered when you go inside the building. And then here through this opening on the barrier you can snipe some guys and that is strongly recommended. Alright, so let's go back and jump inside the building and grab these health bonuses and then grab the red key. But it is a trap, so what I do is grab the red key, kill the shotgunners on the right side and then deal with these enemies from down. I found that way to do with, uh, with this trap much easier. Alright, so let's go inside the building. And near to where we grab the red key, there's a wall you can open, revealing the only secret area of this map with that uh, mega armor inside and this teleporter, so let's take it. And yes, we are back here to the starting area. <clears throat> Since we have the red key now, so we can open the red bars. We flip the switch that will allow to us access to the other side of the underhauls. <laughs> yes, I love the super shotgun, it's so easy to use. There's the blue door, we can, can't open it yet, and there's another blue door. Let's go through. And then I like to use my regular shotgun to kill the enemies around the perimeter. Including these guys down below. Include 
Bullets, Shotgunners, Imps. On Z Dune Base at Sourceport, this place can be damn hard to see, but you can deal with it. Let's go to the other hold. There's another imp. Come on, imp. Okay. So now let's jump down with the super shotgun equipped and destroy everything. Yes, lovely red. Like I said, in close range, this weapon works wonderfully against a group of enemies like those two poor imps. I'll kill you too, shotgunner. Then with the blue key, so we can open the blue doors. And kill more gunners with the super shotgun. Yes, I love to do that. And yes, that's the end. So let's see. We killed everything, we collected everything, and we tagged all the secrets. Alright. So we are finally done. Alright folks, so that was Underhalls. Well, what can I say about this map? Now this map is pretty easy, but it's definitely, definitely fun. I like it so much. Mainly because of the super shotgun. That's my favorite weapon here at, uh, in Doom 2. Also because uh, it is very compact, very cool to play. It has only gunners to kill loads of gunners. And the overall design of this map is pretty nice. It kind of reminds me some kind of water gallery or sewers, and I like these kind of designs. And also the soundtrack user for this level is very nice. It kind of reminds me Brazilian music styles like Bossa Nova and Samba. Yeah, two um, Brazilian music styles, although I don't listen to them so much. I'm much more like a headbanger. <laughs> listen much more to rock and heavy metal, but I respect it. Brazilian genres of music. Anyway, I think there is nothing more to say about this map, so let's move to map 3 that is called the Gantlet. Yes, this map is pretty tough, but that's for the next video, so I see you there. Until the Gantlet, I'm Jimmy GGS91, and bye bye to everyone. Take care, my friends.